Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sharing a realistic morning routine here at our house and I'm so excited to take you guys along with me sharing what I do to get work done at home and I'm also going to share a get ready with me video and give you my updated makeup routine. So let's go ahead and get started. My day usually starts around 7 a.m., give or take, sometimes a little bit earlier, sometimes a little bit later, but I typically will get up a little bit before Brooks, if not at the same time, and I always go and get my robe, and then I come back in and have to try to talk Colt into getting off of the bed. He is a lazy dog and doesn't like to get off, so then I'm going to open up the blinds, turn our air purifier off, and open up the blinds and let some sunlight in. This always gets me going for the day. And I also wanted to tell you guys about this robe. It's from Target and it's a Barefoot Dreams dupe in my opinion. It's so cozy and soft, so I'll link it down below for you guys. And then now I'm going to make the bed. I like to do this first thing in the morning because if not, then I always forget and it'll be like 10 o'clock before I make it. So I just like to get all of the blankets folded and everything nice and tidy. Now I'm heading into the living room and letting Colt out to use the bathroom. And about this time, Brooks is waking up and running down the hallway. So he is always a morning person and is just very energetic in the mornings. Now I'm heading into the kitchen, turning the lights on, and I did some dishes before I went to bed last night, but I let them air dry, so I'm gonna have to put those up at some point. But I'm gonna go ahead and get Brooks's breakfast going. Whenever he wakes up, he is ready to eat, and I am the total opposite. I used to not even eat breakfast. I kind of just do like a light, late breakfast now, but it's just never really been my thing. So anyways, I'm going to pour him some orange juice, and then I'm going to make him some oatmeal. He's been on an oatmeal kick here recently, but other breakfast ideas for him, he really likes blueberry waffles, he likes eggs and bacon, he also likes toast, so that's pretty much his breakfast, and then sometimes he has fruit with it as well, but today was an easy day and we just went with the oatmeal. About that time, Colt is ready to come back inside, so I let him in and then went and got him a treat. Now it's time for my coffee and I love using my Nespresso machine and this is my current favorite capsule. It's so good. It is a shot of espresso and it's just really strong and I love it for lattes in the morning. So I'm going to brew that and this is one of my favorite mugs. It says the gospel changes everything by the Daily Grace Co. I've probably shared this mug on here before but I mean doesn't everybody do you have a favorite mug because this one is definitely mine. My favorite way to sweeten coffee is with oat milk and this maple flavored monk fruit syrup. It is so good. The monk fruit syrup has no added sugar and it doesn't affect your blood sugar. So I love that and it actually tastes really good as well. If you don't have this, you could always use regular maple syrup too. So good. I also like using vanilla sometimes. So I just switch it up on however I'm feeling for the day. 
and then I like to warm it up and froth it and then mix it in with the shot of espresso and it is so good. So now Brooks wanted to have some lovin's so that is what we're doing. There's nothing better in this world than being his mama. So taking those little moments is everything. Now we're gonna head into the office. Brooks is coloring and sometimes he'll go ahead and play in his playroom or just do different things while I get some work done in the mornings, whether that's answering emails or planning out my content for the week or the day. I like to just have a moment to write out a list of all the things that I wanna get accomplished for the day. So that's what I'm doing here. I found this notepad at Target, I believe, in the dollar spot section. And it has been so good for prioritizing the task for the day. And I am a paper and pen kind of girl. I could write it in my phone, but I feel like I would never look at it. So if I have the setting on my desk, I can cross it off as I go throughout the day and it just keeps me on track. Now I'm heading into the playroom to join Brooks and play with him for just a little bit. He loves these magnetiles. They're actually magnetile dupes. I think they're called Picasso tiles, maybe. They're from Amazon and he loves playing with them. He's going to make a dinosaur cage and we just spend some time together. He will be going to a preschool this fall, which is going to be so hard on me not having him here at home but I know he's going to absolutely love it. So I'm soaking in all these extra moments this summer before he goes to school. I just wanna love you, just wanna hold you, just wanna be with you till we grow old. Please tell me you'll stay or take me away. I want you for myself every single day. You said my world on fire. You said Now I'm heading into Brooks's room. I'm gonna turn his TV off and DVD player. I'm gonna open up his blinds, let some sunshine in, and then I'm gonna make his bed, but his bedding was actually in the washing machine. So he used this blanket or a couple of blankets last night. So I'm gonna have to make his bed and put his bedding back on today. But for now, I'm just going to straighten it up a little bit. This is a Sam's Barefoot Dreams dupe. As you can tell, I love this material. It is so cozy. And this is just another little blanket I'm going to throw on there. He's a hot sleeper, so he doesn't even sleep with a comforter anyway, so it's not a big deal. But now I'm gonna lay his clothes out and get him dressed for the day. And he's gonna do a little spin and ta-da, he has his clothes on. He watched this clip back like four times and thought it was so cool. So anyways, now we are heading into our bedroom and I'm going to do a quick workout. I have been trying to do this, honestly, this week. I've done workouts at home five days in a row, so I'm pretty proud of that. But just trying to move my body and get in a better mindset start of the day has really helped me. And it's also a good time for Brooks to get some exercise in as well. After I'm done getting a quick workout in, I get ready for the day and I like to first just wash my face. I'm still using my Tula products and I'm loving them. I've got a scrub that I use first. I like to do this in the mornings. And then I have a face cleanser. It's their Cult Classic one and it's so good. It smells really good too. And then I'm going to use a toner on my face. I like to do this to try to help even out my skin tone. And then I'm going to put a moisturizer on. So that is my skincare routine. And I also wanted to tell you guys about this new lash serum that I've been using. 
it is by hello skincare and it is so good it's their lash therapy and i do have a discount code it's kaylin 20 for 20 percent off and it is amazing it has grown my lashes so much over the last couple of months so anyways, now I'm going to put my makeup on and I like to use this case to store all my makeup in. I got it for vacation a couple months ago and it's worked out great. I haven't taken my makeup out yet, so I'll link this down below. It's from Amazon, under $20. It's so sturdy. So here are some of the makeup products that I love. I either use my IT Cosmetics CC Cream, my Saint Makeup, or Estee Lauder Double Wear for foundation. It just depends on the day. I also love my Tarte Shape Tape, my Laura Mercier Translucent Powder, Too Faced Bronzer, my NARS Blush, and my Laura Geller Gilded Honey Highlighter. Those are my favorite things for my face. I also love this eyeliner from L'Oreal and the Red Aspen Mascara is also really good. And then sometimes I will set my makeup with that Milani Make It Last setting spray. So that is what I use. I like to get a damp beauty blender and blend all of my makeup in. For eyeshadow, I've just been using my bronzer, putting it in my crease, and then I've taken a little bit of highlighter and put it right on my lid. And then I just put mascara on. I don't use eyeliner every day anymore. I've just been doing a lighter look, especially for summertime. So that red Aspen mascara has been my go-to. And then I'm just going to fill in my brows with this palette from BH Cosmetics. I've had it forever. And then I like to line my lips with a little bit of lip liner from Jordana and then put on some chapstick. And that is it. Pretty simple. And then for my hair, I did curl it the day before. So I'm just going to run my fingers through it and get any tangles out. Then I'm going to put my jewelry on and my Apple Watch. And I'm also going to have a hair tie um, around my wrist because I do like to throw my hair up throughout the day usually if I'm doing stuff around the house or whatnot. So that is it for my look. But if I curl my hair, I use this Numi wand or this Irresistible Me straightener. And I love this Vegamore dry shampoo. So sometimes I use those, but not every day. So now I'm going to head into the kitchen and get things cleaned up and straightened up for the day. I'm just going to dry these dishes off and then I had a few dishes left to do from this morning that I'm going to clean real quick and get those put away as well. Step of the way. 
once the kitchen is cleaned up, that's pretty much the end of our morning routine. From there, I usually will just grab a quick snack that's kind of like a in-between breakfast and lunch, usually a Lara bar or fruit or something, and a big cup of ice water. That is what I sip on all day long, and then I usually will get started filming. So thank you guys so much for following along my morning routine. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give it a like and don't forget to subscribe. I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys. Thank you.